and a COVID outbreak shuts down a private school in Matthews, forcing students to shift to remote learning just days into the new school year. Fox 46's Robin Kennedy was the first to break that story about the COVID cases at Covenant Day School. And Robin, you spoke with the head of the school today. What did he say? Annie, the head of school, told me absolutely nothing, except this is a private school, and if they have anything to share with the public, they would let us know. But Fox 46 got a copy of this email sent to parents by school administrators. It says, since last Friday, 20 people at Covenant Day School the high school have tested positive for COVID and eight of those cases were reported in the last 24 hours. The email says the high school was closed today so that the school could do contact tracing and wait for the results of other pending COVID tests. Students could come back today to get materials so that they can begin remote learning tomorrow. Mecklenburg County Public Health has received a verbal report of at least eight cases at Covenant Day. The county health director tells us there was a retreat last week with middle and high schoolers and that the cases seem to be related to that retreat. Just moments ago, I asked Mecklenburg County Public Health Director Gibby Harris what information parents have the right to know when it comes to outbreaks at schools. What people need to understand is just because there was a case in the school does not mean your child was exposed. You will hear from either the school or us that your child was exposed if that happened. Um, I know it's hard not to worry um, and, and to think you're being kept in the dark, but we need to reassure people that um, we are being very careful about any child case that comes in now, Gibby Harris says Covenant Day High School chose to go remote on their own in order to do contact tracing and to wait to get have time to get those results from those pending COVID tests. I'm live in Matthews. Robin Kennedy, Fox 46.